Welcome to another review from TFL Car. And today, Nathan and myself are reviewing the brand new Dodge Grand Caravan. Nathan, where are you? I'm doing this review properly from the passenger's perspective. Nathan, you can't review a car without driving it. That's crazy. No, 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 no. This isn't even a car. It's a minivan. It's built to take people places. So the passenger compartment is the right place to do a review. Tell you what, you do the driving, I'll do the passenger review. Yeah, I will never pass up an opportunity to drive, so you got yourself a deal, my friend. Sweet. So I've been driving this Grand Caravan for a week and I am impressed with this Pentastar. That is some mighty good power. Yeah, it's a minivan. It doesn't handle particularly well. It doesn't corner particularly well, but you know, that's not what it's about. It's about hauling people and that part it does very well. You know, I see Roman out there messing around with the uh, Pentastar V6. Yeah, it's a great engine. It really is. but. Chrysler Group LLC has managed to stuff it in just about every car they build. In fact, the only one I can think of that they haven't messed with yet is the Fiat 500. And it's only a matter of time before they find a way to shoehorn it into that and they'll call it like, I don't know, the Americano. Look at the rear seats. These go down, you have tons of space. And they're relatively simple to do. Even an ape like me can figure out pulling one, two, Three does something right. Uh -huh. There it goes, yeah. three. Yeah, sure. Voila. If I can do it, anybody can do it. Here we go. Not bad off the line. It's got a muted growl. Was up to six and a half thousand RPM, and here comes 60 right now. Not bad. I just got 9.9 .9 seconds. It could be the six speed. It's not bad, especially with uh, a big, heavy box on wheels. Hey Nathan, I thought this van had seven people. I only count six seats. <laughs> Aha, let me show you. This has what's called stow and go seating. You have to remove the floor mat, lift, this little doohickey up, and there's your seat right there, okay? All you need to do from there is lift it up. A little this, a little that. Seven seats. Right, here's my one issue. I am not enthralled by the style of this minivan. It's a little too blocky, a little too heavy-handed. From the driver's seat, it's great. From out here, not so much. You know, Nathan, the Grand Caravan has been around a long time and it competes with other minivans like the Quest, the Odyssey, and the Sienna. How do you think it fits in those cars? I think it fits in a larger category. I think that this is the bigger of the three in terms of its capacity and its overall ability with the new V6. It's really powerful. It is really powerful, and it's super roomy. I think that not only me and you fit. I think three Daves would fit in here with two Nathans. Exactly. As always, this is Roman. And Nathan. See you guys next time. Ciao. I'm eating right now, so I got my McRoman. <laughs> this is what a passenger is supposed to do, right? All right, dude. Just fair warning. I'm about to do the zero to 60. Really? Yeah, really. Here we go. Okay, but you gotta wait. Whoa! Whoa, 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 whoa! Oh! Oh, sh it's in my underwear! Oh, straight in the underwear! <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh, Nathan, is that what a passenger's supposed to do? I was trying to wet hold it. So ah! Oh, it's, it's, oh, it's on the back side. It's on the back side. I need, I, do you have a towel? I don't have a towel. I'm driving, dude. We'll just uh, we'll just carry on. Well, You're a professional. On. Come on, oh, carry on. It's a warm-up place. Stupid cup. It's what a passenger's supposed to do. That's what I was trying to do. And then the next thing you know, you don't test it out of 16 vans. Although it was fairly quick. <laughs>